Hey guys, welcome to the channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. <clears throat> so, I want to do a love reading today. We got the four of wands at the bottom of the deck, so it's very, very befitting. It's crazy. Something about the maybe red roses or just the color red is significant and i'm not just saying it because i'm wearing red but definitely we got the devil here yeah definitely the color red or pink is this pink it's probably like a pinkish more of a fuchsia but red or pink i don't know we got the ten of pentacles so somebody could be obsessed with some form of abundance that's coming in for you or something long term heavy capricorn energy but yeah i want to get a love reading going y'all this smoke going so i feel like yeah your your um angels are definitely protecting you guys Somebody could really like like Ariana Grande or something. Or like, yeah, the color like pink or red. Think about that. I'm hearing Dragon Tales, Dragon Tales. Somebody may have watched uh, Dragon Tales when they were younger or like. <laughs> oh no, that's cute. This even looks like the little the color of the stone. Okay. <laughs> we got the two of cups. So if you guys were like manifesting a relationship, the will of fortune, baby, is here. Just know that it's coming in. Whatever it is that you're wanting in love. Or some of y'all, this could be same sex as like two women on this card, but it doesn't have to be. Or somebody could be like non-binary or like a uh, pansexual. Um Yeah. But love is love. And love is blooming. <laughs> So with the Wheel of Fortune here, yeah, I definitely feel like something is coming around um, that's supposed to be in your life, some form of a collaboration or connection to someone. Oof. Okay, so again, the devil, but it did come out in the reverse. It did come out in reverse. I just picked it up. I turned it around. But some form of like a toxic energy could be over. I'm feeling like some form of a toxic like type of like maybe way of being. This could even uh, speak to obsession again. Like somebody could be obsessed with like having some form of like a relationship with you with the hybrid fence. So we have... Capricorn Taurus energy here so far and it's crazy because again I heard like the devil is defeated like let's be for real like amen <laughs> because these are two opposing energies so it's given like source could have helped you defeat some form of like toxicity that you were dealing with it's very befitting because this the way this shit is burning it's burning so it's just a lot of smoke okay so I feel like mm, source is definitely protecting you guys I feel like you are such a sweetheart somebody have like a little ball on their phone like you know like that kind of goes in like the charger cord or like you just have like a furry ball that's connected to like your phone or something. Somebody really likes the color like purple or like pink or something or blue. Um, but yeah, have you on like the purple or something like that? Somebody could have like pink hair, pink hair, purple hair or like teal hair. Um, but yeah, I feel like somebody is looking to like have some form of like a commitment with you. I'm also getting like a lot of divine protection around somebody. Somebody could be like heavily like spiritual um or religious um like with the keys here is definitely given like um i don't know why i'm hearing archangel in my head i just heard archangel so something about an archangel could be really covering someone right now somebody could have an archangel that just follows them at all time i'm getting like somebody wants the key to your heart though type of energy because like you could be a sweetheart with strength we have leo energy out here so somebody could have been trying to hold themselves back from how they were feeling about you you are someone who is very strong as well something about this lion with a halo on top of his head so whoever this person is coming towards you could be a leo or you could be a leo i get a very i don't know y'all i'm getting like damn i just, I just got like it's not a bad energy it's like it's gonna be like hmm. somebody can have like a certain charm about them because i don't know i'm hearing like dazzling or something because it's something about the way that this is like sparkling something about someone's hair could be really pretty or beautiful or like really big um let me see okay so we got pisces energy here we got the page of wands we have that so i, I with the hangman here i definitely feel like something is on hold some form of communication that's supposed to be coming through we got hermit energy virgo Somebody definitely could be concealing the fact that they do want this relationship that's supposed to come in for you guys. Uh, I saw that Wheel of Fortune energy. And it could have been a karmic holdup. I'm hearing something, something about karma with that devil energy coming out in reverse. 
something about karma with the six of swords something is about to be moving into like calmer waters damn something is about to be moving like into calmer waters with someone they could feel guided towards you this could even be after like they leave something hmm. i want to speak on that let's see what this is Somebody's getting enlightenment. Somebody's getting some form of enlightenment. First thing I looked at, it's a lot of options here, right? Seven of Cups, options, right? Or like, it could be illusions, confusion. But the first thing I looked at was this ring. So somebody could be, I don't know if they were getting enlightenment about a commitment. I just get a heavenly, like somebody wants a commitment with you though. What is that song? It's like, I don't know. It just, it's like, it's like a, I don't know. That's literally the only part of the song I know. That's what I'm hearing. Swords, you got to do better than that. I don't know, y'all. But I don't know. If it, I feel like it has something to do with this because it just came out of nowhere in my head. But if somebody wants to, like, come towards you, just... King of Wands, though. So it could be an Aries Leo Sag in somebody's energy, heavy Libra with this justice card here. Somebody wants to bring you justice, baby. Okay. What is their idea of justice? Um, but I feel like this could be who wants to bring you some form of like a love situation. What was this King of Wands? Okay. It could be in like a meditative state right now or you were heavily on this person's mind. Or they see you as somebody who's like, you could meditate too. Like somebody could see you as somebody who's like very tapped in. Like, what does this king of wands want? They want the ace of wands. Didn't I say it was something significant about roses or something? Pink roses, red roses, whatever. Or just flowers. Like somebody could be like a ladies man or a gentleman. But like, look how he's looking. He holding that flower in his hand and look what's on the ace of wands. The same flower, baby. Somebody want to give you the whole flower. <laughs> No, nah, let me stop. <laughs> well, hey, that's what it's looking like, but what can I say? No, nah, but hmm. I'm not gonna say too much. Let's see what he got. <laughs> that's probably how y'all gonna be like, let me see what you got. You know, I ain't gonna I ain't gonna say too much. Yeah, sorry y'all. Hope y'all gonna make sure my so somebody could be a little nervous i i was picking on i was picking up on that before i even came on here like nervousness it was a certain nervousness and i was like it was like butterflies but not really butterflies it was like excitement more so like not because butterflies is more so like a nervousness but it, it was like an excitement but also like a you make somebody feel very like again it's just giving like enchanted like you make them feel like you're the magical one or something like that so i do feel like somebody wants to bring some form of passion to you you got somebody feeling fired up. Somebody could be tatted up with the emperor. I, you know what's crazy? Because when I saw this king of wands, I heard emperor. And I was like, I, that's why I was like, I ain't going to say nothing. Because I was hearing with this ace of wands, king of wands. Like, I was like, mm, I already know what's going on. <laughs> Especially with this ace of wands, like, baby. But somebody could be tatted up. Because I was hearing, tatted up. Tatted up. <laughs> Somebody could have a lot of tattoos. Somebody could want to get your names at it. I don't know. But like, this emperor could definitely be an Aries. Hey, fire here. I'm smiling so much because somebody fired up. If, whether they're a fire sign or not. You can find, or they, whether they're a fire sign or not. We also have Leo here with this damn uh, strength. Because I was also hearing a chariot in my head. So somebody could be a cancer too. Because I was just hearing chariot, chariot. So whoever that cancer is, if you're dealing with one, they're coming towards you, baby. They want to be known. They want to let your ass know. That is them, but we got a king of wands here. Um, who this could be an Aries Leo Sag, heavy Aries and Leo. Um, this person got a lot of passion for you, whether they're a fire sign or not. You could find this person to be very attractive. They could even dress like this, or like in suits, or like very business savvy. <laughs> 
I don't know. Somebody could wear like button suits or like I mean button suit, but I don't know. Somebody could be like a businessman or something. Like, okay, yeah, this emperor. Look who it is. This is the will of fortune. This is definitely the person who's like meant to come around. It's definitely a relationship I'm getting that's meant to come around for somebody here. A collaboration is meant to come around. It's gonna come around and it's gonna mm, shake you to the ground and it's gonna come around. Don't come around though. <laughs> and here, are you ready? Ready or not? Here I come. You can't hide. I'm gonna find you. Make you. Did she say, make you love me? Somebody on the judgment. It could be an air sign. We got the King of Swords judgment here. The sun. Like somebody, something could be getting like illuminated about an air sign. I definitely feel like though, yeah, y'all got somebody that got like a lot of love for y'all, like a lot of emotion that's coming in. This could even be it. I mean, maybe it's an air sign. Somebody wants to explain this to you though, but somebody definitely could be like making a judgment call or like, or like maybe explaining how they feel or revealing how they feel or. <laughs> Okay, we got the full card here. So that's Aquarius energy, Pisces with the Will of Fortune. So somebody's feeling like, yeah, I'm here and just go for it type of energy. Somebody gonna be hurt. I don't know if it's like a, a fire sign feminine that's gonna be hurt about this. Somebody could have thought that they were this person's match, or maybe at one point they were. Like, I'm not. I mean, maybe it was on a divine level, or it was just like a, a match, a vibrational match or a karmic match but somebody may even feel a little slighted to see that somebody's actually wanting to come towards you this person is really wanting to take this leap of faith though y'all i'm not even gonna lie we got the lovers with the five of swords here and the king of pentacles yeah it's like more than one masculine could feel like slighted over like oh wait a minute let me just make sure i'm getting like lovers like heavy on the lovers that wanted this either offer or mm, and it could be like different, a mixture of like masculines and feminines or like to see something coming towards someone, like an investment. A Gemini could feel, because I asked like who was going to feel slighted. The magician came out. So this could be somebody that's like a, a, somebody that was trying to manifest you or your person or this could be a Gemini or somebody could have been trying to like use mess. Spell work. <laughs> I couldn't even think of the word. Sorcery. I was going to say like sorcery. I don't know why sorcery came in my head. Like sorcery. Somebody could be like a sorceress or like somebody definitely was trying to like, somebody's going to be upset. Heavy Gemini energy out here. We got the lovers and we got the magician. So I don't know. But I don't know. I just feel like somebody's going to be upset to see this Ace of Cups coming in for someone who has been manifesting like new love into their life or something like that. Yeah, Seven of Wands and it's protected. So I don't know. Even if someone was trying to do some form of like manifesting against your love life, even if it wasn't that, it's just trying to manifest you towards them. If that's not your person, it's not going to work. So I feel like your love life is protected, especially some form of like new love that's about to show up for you and again for some of y'all be patient baby <laughs> with the queen of physicals and the four of wands baby yeah some of y'all gonna be moving into a very stable energy with someone very soon and i say be patient because we have this night knight of pentacles energy somebody's gonna take their time either coming towards you or like when y'all meet they're gonna want to take their time to get to know you but with the queen of pentacles that's a wife so it's like you are the perfect I just feel like you have you don't mind taking your time because you're not in a rush to like um it's like you know that good things take time type of energy. Somebody has like a very mature like mindset or like you know you, you, you know rushing things and it doesn't really you give you a good result. At least you found that out possibly like in the past. So yeah, somebody has like definitely new love coming in. Heavy on like the pink or purple hair for someone. It's all throughout this written. Um you could definitely be an earth sign. We had that king of pentacles as well. So it's something about a marriage with this four of wands or a commitment. Somebody could even see you as like someone that they would want to like one day possibly marry. Yeah, with the page of swords. And this person could, dare I say, already be watching you. Somebody definitely could be like getting readings on you with the high priestess and the page of swords. Some of y'all could do like, yeah, some this is reading. Somebody could you some of y'all could be like readers. 
<laughs> the ace of pentacles somebody could like get a reading on this person that they wanted to like give this offer to which is like you somebody could be like trying to get a reading like on like the sweetheart energy or like watching you through like readings like trying to get information on you and that's my ice maker machine but i'm definitely getting the energy of um yeah somebody's wanting to bring you this ace of pentacles ace of cups ace of pentacles you could definitely be like this, this hierophant, high priestess energy. I'm just getting to like whoever this person is that's coming towards you. They could see that both of y'all like match energies or something like that. This could be somebody again that they they're they're the ten of cups again. This would be like a very wholesome connection. Like Taurus Pisces energy out here. Like somebody could feel like they would match your stability. They would match like your 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 values and beliefs. I know that's my ice maker, but that should be scaring me. Um, yeah, we got Leo energy with the sun here. So something about something being illuminated to somebody about like something. That, uh, let's see what this is. Somebody could be leaving something or someone out in the cold. We got Leo Sagittarius energy out here. And this could be illuminated to somebody. Like somebody could feel left out in the cold. Somebody could feel like left behind. Um, again, to see that. Something from this could be from this person's past too. Like uh, I feel like this person could be dealing with things from their past. Whatever this person is that's supposed to be coming towards y'all, that's like that will of fortune energy. Like it's meant to come around. Um, I do feel like this person, they're dealing with like a third party from their past. I'm not saying they're still talking to this person or like dealing with them sexually, but it's given like this person could still be like wrapping up something or like they're dealing with something from the past. With the eight of wands, I do see forward movement here and a connection with you and this person. Again, heavy on like the equal, I heard equal opportunity, something about equal opportunities, but equal, it's going to be equal reciprocity. You are this person, no, you. Somebody's worried about being single. This could be you or someone else. This could be someone else. Um with the death possibly because of an ending like say somebody just went through an ending that like this maybe the person that's coming towards you they could be still dealing with like like i said that person maybe from their past or someone or something from their past and maybe this is like worrying them about like going out and being like this nine of pentacles energy or somebody's worried about someone being single scorpio energy here like a transformation that somebody possibly is about to like um go through or align with it's something about somebody's worried about like this this angle this, excuse me this single energy something about angles somebody could have been in like the angles hospital um somebody's trying to hold on to somebody because possibly they don't want an energy an, an ending to happen this could be like a scorpio yeah taurus libra this could be a taurus or a libra or someone is holding on to like a taurus or a libra because they don't want like an ending to happen the five of cups somebody could be in regret and really heartbroken right now this could be a taurus or libra energy going through like a tower moment or you could be this like empress energy um i feel like somebody's trying to choose a new path i do feel like you're going to heal from something an aquarius could be significant yeah, I see some some form of like truth coming out. Heavy Aquarius energy. Heavy Aquarius energy. We got the King of Queen of Swords. We got the Queen of Swords with the Star card. We got the King of Swords with the Six of Swords. And this is both Aquarius energy. Aquarius, King of Swords is air. Aquarius with the Star. And this is like, so it could be like two Aquariuses that are significant or with the Six of Wands. I feel like it's going to be an ending in a, in a like, whatever this is, this could have already happened or it's coming. Like, some somebody's going to be, like, leaving someone else. This could have already happened. Ace of Swords. And it's for some, someone, it could have came, like, unexpectedly. But I feel like somebody else um, could have known that they were, like, going to leave a situation. Somebody don't want to work on nothing no more. Somebody don't want to work on a situation with somebody no more. Heavy air sign energy or, like, Seven of Swords. Somebody could be seen as, like, deceptive. And um, I do feel like somebody's coming for like this Queen of Pentacles energy. This could be what's holding something up, what's slowing something down. And again, I don't know if this is going to start. Something could like low-key start some form of conflict. But um, this lovers, this is definitely like some of y'all. This could be like same sex, Gemini energy here. Or... 
I feel like somebody feels like you really matched your energy. Okay, we're gonna get some tea, baby. I'm gonna dig into this. What we got 20, okay. Somebody could be the age 20. I heard 22, 23, 29. <laughs> but yeah, definitely like the age between like the they're in their 20s. I'm hearing somebody's in their 20s though, specifically. Um My girls are good. Let's put this back up here. Yeah. Tell me about this person that wants to come towards my collective. Let me know more about this person that wants to come in towards my collective. Yeah, this person could be a little worried. I was feeling this. This is like an empress energy who wants to come towards somebody. This could be a Taurus or a Libra. This person has been holding back on how they feel for you. Um, again, I get a very like, this person is very like, um, so cute. This could be like a very cute person. <laughs> I don't know why cute is coming to mind. But with the empress, um, that's Taurus, Libra energy, the stars is in her head. So you could see somebody's like wish fulfillment too, especially if you like are the masculine energy, and, or whether you're a feminine or a or, uh, or you're a woman or a man, like you could just hold the more mask. But somebody wants to come towards you, especially like if you're a same sex or you're into like same sex or like I don't know, or you just could just be someone who like you know. Even if you're straight, I feel like this could be like an emperor. Like take what resonates though, and just flip the roles. But this is definitely giving like an empress energy that's wanting to come towards somebody. Yeah, we have death, Scorpio energy. So somebody's going through like a a transformation going on with this person seven of pentacles something about investments investing somebody wants to take a leap of faith with the full card here i feel like this the, how they see you is that it would be like a risk or to take a leap of faith towards you especially if somebody just experiencing like an ending with in another part of their life or with someone else heavy scorpio energy again this is this person who's one of this ace of wands before the emperor came out so again like i said even if you're straight don't take it like oh i'm not gay this could just mean that this is your emperor but like you're coming out as the empress that somebody got their eyes on it. They have not let you go. Because again, it could be like an Aries energy, a Taurus, Libra energy, Aquarius we got out here. With justice. Again, this person wants to bring you justice. Libra, heavy Libra energy. Yeah, somebody's choosing a new path. I'm getting like a very, like you and this person could have spent like a past life together, not to sound like. You know, all oh, everything, you know, it's just always about past lives, but no, dead ass. I'm telling y'all what I'm feeling. And it's always confirmed. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is your emperor or your empress, whatever whatever the case may be. Somebody sees their person as like, I'm telling y'all. What is that song? Moment for Life by Nicki Minaj. Because I was hearing I fly with the stars in the skies. I am no longer trying to survive. I believe that life is a prize, but to live doesn't mean you're alive. Don't worry about me and who I fire. I get what I desire. It's my empire. I know the lyrics. I'm doing all I'm looking them up, but like, I couldn't think of the song name. It's like I'm just trying to tell you I'm the umpire. I sprinkle holy water. So, and I will retire with the crown. Yes. No, I'm not lucky. I'm blessed. Yeah. But something about, though, in this very moment, I'm king. In this very moment, I slay Goliath with the sling. Something about Goliath, because there's no, there's no way. That's just how I know this is confirmation, because I heard David, like, the, the name David earlier. So, somebody's name could be David, but also, like, the story of, like, David in the Bible of, like, um, I think he was calling upon, like, God or something like that. So, somebody could be fighting some form of, like, a bigger battle or a battle that seems bigger than them. But I'm hearing, but God, like, God is always bigger than any giant or any battle in your life. And I feel like now is your time. Somebody could be like a king, like energy, or like this emperor stepping into their power, or this empress, or just know whatever it is that you're going through, or whatever it seems like you're battling, you're going to come out on top. This very moment I bring, put it on everything that I will retire with the ring and I will retire with the crown. Yes, I know I'm not lucky. I'm blessed. Yes, clap for the heavyweight champ. Me, but I gotta do it all along. Wait, what? <laughs> Southside Jamaica. So somebody could be from like Jamaica or Queens, New York. Hollywood can change me. Shout out to my head. Sorry that you couldn't phase me. Yeah, people just 
People could be mad that they can't like phase you. People could be mad that they can't like get a reaction out of you. The chariot. Like somebody's gonna be coming towards you. Again, remember I told you I was hearing this chariot energy to cancer. Six of swords. I was hearing chariot, chariot. Or they could just be like somebody was really wanting to come towards y'all because they see you as the star, baby. I'm telling you, with the star car, you shine bright to somebody. Somebody likes the way you dress or something like that. Somebody really feels like you fit them. Even if it's like you're different than them, you dress different than them. Like somebody just feels fit. Like it feels like you see in a, in a, I heard like in an odd way, but it's still cute. Like somebody feels you. Like this person could be like cute, but they find you to be cute too, or something like that. With the star, it could be an Aquarius, or you could be an Aquarius with the Queen of Swords here and the star. Um, but heavy on somebody's with this. These are two vehicle cards or like movement cards, six of swords and the chariot. Like somebody's feeling divinely guided towards you, so they going. Even if they gotta be on a, a damn boat, a train, a yacht, a plane, they coming. Wing shot, they they coming. <laughs> we love to see it. Ace of Swords, Four of Wands, Four of Wands is commitments, marriage, soulmate. <laughs> like somebody wants this with you. They want loyalty. They want truth, honor, devotion. This person could even want to like something about. Uh, I heard a move in date. Somebody sees this as like full on wish fulfillment. Like, yes, you could be finna get communication from this person. Now, the pentacles, I feel like when they're single, something about when this person is single or when they are not no longer dealing with someone or you. Or you could already be in this energy. People are gonna be upset. I feel like, cause I'm, I'm clarifying, somebody could be like upset with like, either, especially if like you're in the public eye or somebody gets a lot of attention or like, again, this, this relationship could draw a lot of attention. Someone's going to be upset. Somebody could even try to talk shit I'm hearing. Whoever this person is, I'm asking like, who is this person? Three of Swords Tower. It's somebody who's heartbroken. I don't know if they're heartbroken over you or this person. We got Scorpio energy out here. Could be air. It could be like, mm. But it's because somebody's going through like a tower. I don't know if somebody that again didn't see this coming or this is coming like as an unexpected like somebody could be like so surprised to see somebody come towards you. <laughs> and it's like it's something about a foundation crumbling for this person when this happens. Devil. This is that person. Remember it came out in reverse. Yeah, we got Capricorn energy out here. Somebody's going to feel like in regret once this comes in because I heard once this comes in it's up and stuck. Locked in. I ain't going to say the rest of that. Heavy Capricorn energy out here. I'm telling y'all, and that Queen of Pentacles came out at first is what with what like that? Was it like the Ace of Cups or something? Somebody has like, I forgot what it came out with, but I believe this Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, it could be a Virgo. You could be a Virgo with judgment. Somebody could be making a judgment call on a Queen of Pentacles. Like right, to come towards. Yeah, with high priestess, especially if you, I feel like y'all are this Queen of Pentacles energy, this Empress Queen of Pentacles, because it came out earlier as the Queen of Pentacles. Um, you could definitely be like a Virgo, a Taurus, a Capricorn, heavy. We got the high priestess. You could be like into tarot and to, um, just using your intuition, spirituality in, in any way, shape, or form. I feel like somebody's low key making a judgment call on you. We have the King and Queen of Cups. <laughs> you be like a water sign. You could be like an earth sign. A Pisces could be significant with this high priestess here. Ooh. Somebody gonna be like, somebody's going to be like upset that possibly they use their, I don't know, somebody's gonna be upset that they didn't play their cards right. Once something comes in, nine of cups, because somebody's actually gonna realize that you're real life wish fulfillment for them. So I don't know if it was somebody that was playing in your face at one point with the lovers. Yeah, Gemini energy. So it could be like a new lover that's coming in for you or. It's, it's like whether it was somebody in your life, I get that um, somebody's going to be a little upset to see that somebody is moving towards Ten of Pentacles, the lovers. Like, I'm telling y'all, once this comes in, it's given like, this is not the type of person who's going to be like leaving your life. They're not no Knight of Swords energy. Now we got the King of Pentacles. This is going to be somebody who wants to marry you. King of Queen of Cups, King of Queen of Pentacles. And I'm not saying right away on some old, give me your hand. But it's given like, this is going to be a true partner, okay? And with the Wheel of Fortune again with the King of Wands. And look who's coming back out. So it's given like, I'm, I'm, regardless of the zodiac signs, it's getting like somebody sees you as a real counterpart. And some of y'all could have like options. A couple people could feel like you match them for different reasons. Um, but I feel like something about you having to choose with this lovers. 
possibly about walking away from stuff. Somebody could definitely be like ghost in a situation. I'm hearing like a heavy ghost in vibe um, with the five of pentacles, eight of cups. Like you could be like ghost in lovers or this person is with the hangman, Pisces energy. Something could feel like, somebody could feel like something just is not moving forward right now or slow down. With the two of cups, a relationship. Um, especially because I feel like somebody's coming towards you. But for some of y'all, this is somebody who feels like maybe somebody that they wanted or they were in a relationship with. It's like, it's no longer like somebody walked away from somebody or they're going to. Page of Wands, Page of Swords. Some form of communication is about to come in about a relationship. Six of Wands and with the Two of Cups here. And this is going to be really successful. Like whatever form of relationship that, or whatever, form, whatever form of communication that comes in, it could be pertaining to a relationship or relations that somebody is wanting with you. And I'm definitely feeling like this is going to be a success, baby. Baby. Six of Wands and Temperance. Like somebody's trying to like balance. Or this is going to bring a lot of like balance and healing into your life. Somebody can see you as like an earth angel with temperance here. Who is this? Oh, so okay. So. It's a king of swords. It's gonna be a Gemini Libra Aquarius is gonna feel a little hurt. I was feeling this with the Knight of Wands and the Ten of Swords. Like somebody gonna be mad that they play their cards right though. How the fuck you mad? This is the energy that your ass was in. Like somebody could have been stabbing you on your back and expecting you to stick around for the for the clown. No, we don't stick around for clowns. We send your ass to the circus. Okay, clock in. So we send your ass to the circus. Somebody wants you to be like blind to something they were doing to you and you close that motherfucking door on their toes. Okay? I'm here and lock the damn door. You locked it. It's no coming back. With the moon here. Somebody's in their feelings. We got Pisces, Cancer, Leo energy here. But heavy, um, somebody could have definitely been like not a ten of swords, not a wands energy. Like if you were dealing with like somebody that was like, if you were wondering if somebody was like being deceptive, they were eight of swords and they're worried now. This is the person who's like lingering and worried. But sure, you could be protecting your energy from this person. But the magician, they're worried that some form of a manifestation is coming in for you. Heavy, heavy Gemini energy. This definitely could have been like a Gemini doing this to somebody. They could feel like rejected now with the four of cups at the bottom of the wands, at the, at the bottom of the deck, <laughs> at the bottom of the wands. But the Ace of Pentacles, because somebody is about to have like have an upgrade or like a new offer that comes in that possibly is going to take your attention off of like a situation or like a person that even if it wasn't on them before, like it's given like even now, even more so, you're just going to be blessed. At least this is how somebody's seeing it in the future with the Three of Wands. Like somebody could feel like in the future, like something is really going to go into your favor that you've been manifesting. With the Knight of Swords, somebody, somebody could have been trying to like... Somebody, I don't know if somebody knows that this King of Wands is coming in for you. Somebody could have been trying to slow this down, but how can you clown? <laughs> how can you clown? Somebody could be like friends with the person that's coming towards you or like uh, Ace of Cups, Three of Cups. I don't know. This is still coming in for you regardless. Okay, so some of y'all got a decision to make. Somebody, somebody here could have like men and women that... <laughs> Ain't no wrong with that, but don't be out here playing people and shit, you know. Be real. If you're just exploring your options, then that's cool too. But uh, but uh, but uh, whoo, whoo, whoo. friendship that's that three of cups MG I was just seeing. Yeah, somebody could feel like, um, they I don't know, they can want to start off as friends. This could be a friend, this could be somebody who. Um, it's a friend of a friend. Somebody could be friends with your person that knows you. I want to know. I want to know what love is. Sacrifice. Yeah, somebody going to have to sacrifice something. Um, making sacrifices to have this connection. With friendship again, wait, wait a minute. Somebody may have to let go of a friendship that was like toxic or like that they were holding on to. For somebody, this person like wishes that maybe they could be your friend first. Or like something is gonna start off like on a friendship level, is what I'm actually getting. The divine timing. So yeah, let's just give this time to unfold naturally. I'm hearing though, um, but if it's meant to be in your life, it's it's coming, baby. It's it's just best believe this is coming. The divine timing. It's the reason why sources having someone wait though with the clock on here. I heard somebody gonna be around for the long run when they do come in though. So just give it time, okay? Because baby, this person when they do come in, they're not leaving. 
and no one get that in their life. It's, it's gonna be it's, a, it's in a cute way, but it's also in a like I need that shit. Like when somebody come in, they're not leaving. <laughs> Come on, Swords. What's going on with these love birds? Yep, toxicity. Somebody definitely could be getting over some form of toxicity from the past. Um, you, this could be you or them. I saw the devil come out in reverse, though, but we got on the right path. So just know that, yeah, you're on the right path. No matter what's transpired so far, like you've been doing the work, you're on the right path. Somebody could be about to like celebrate soon. Nurture. Make sure that you're nurturing yourself, especially if you did just get out of some form of like a, a toxic relationship or abusive relationship. With somebody, I heard trust in the divine timing, but also trust your gut. Trust that you know what's not good for you and your self work. You know when somebody's trying to make you feel less than or make your mind wonder and you know when unseen. Somebody's trying to make you feel like you weren't you they didn't see you, your your worth. That's why you're gonna have somebody that's with boundaries. Literally create those boundaries. They didn't deserve you anyway, and they don't deserve you now. They didn't deserve you then, they don't deserve you now. For some of y'all, y'all gonna have like this emperor or this empress coming towards you, um, man or woman. Um, somebody could want to give you an apology, but some of y'all got somebody that's coming towards you now that's going to be able to match you, okay? In the past, you were dealing with fucking pages, not people who were an empress to your emperor or emperor to your empress. Why would you think that was going to work? Imperfections, yeah. Mm -hmm. You got to learn to accept your own, like, flaws. Somebody's going to help you to, like, learn every, I mean, um, love every part of your being, your, your own imperfections. Like, you will no longer have to, like, cover up or, like, chase these, like, boys or, or this is what somebody's learning. Like, um, something about somebody's realizing they don't have to be perfect with you or perfect for you. Like, embracing your imperfection, imperfections, excuse me, and letting go of fear. But yeah, I definitely feel like a certain level of anticipation. That's damn near that energy I was getting when I was like, it's not really like butterflies, but it's more so like excitement. Like, somebody could be like anticipating, like coming towards you. Like, again, like I get the sense that for some of you, this person could definitely still, they could already be like watching you with door, doorway. Source is definitely going to open like a, a doorway. Yeah, with heartbreak. I don't know if somebody's like healing from like a heartbreak or like you had to heal from certain heartbreaks in the past. Um, but now it's like a new door is opening. So that's why it's like when one door closes, understand that a better one is being open. Don't come to like this new relationship. I'm not going to say it like that, but like with baggage, it's giving like take your time to heal. Take the time that you need because what's for you is going to be for you. You don't want to bring this new baggage. I mean, this baggage to your relationship. But um, here, I like, don't take too much time now. But like, yeah, you, you want to release that emotional baggage. And I feel like this new person is actually going to give you time to do that. They're going to understand a little something about what you've gone through. They're not going to judge you or make you feel like, oh, you got to heal. You got to heal. You got to heal. Because it's like, I understand, boo. I done been through it. I'm hearing like, I've been through worse. So some of y'all, it's not a competition. But you might even find out that somebody's been through like something. They've been through the ringer. You tell them your story and they get them drunk. They story. You like, damn. Like, uh. I'm not going to try to do that because I'm always just stupid. Y'all like my Barbie coat. <laughs> but somebody could be definitely releasing a lot of baggage. They could have been with somebody that they thought that they was their end all be all. Or, um, but I'm actually getting like this. Yeah, with surprise. This could be a surprise to someone. I actually get like it's going to be a surprise to many people once this comes in. But for some of you, the divine is about to surprise you with something that's coming in for you. Um, or someone that's coming in for you that you possibly were not expecting. I'm definitely getting um, with illusions here. Somebody definitely was being fed some form of illusions in the past. Or somebody was trying to do this to you. Like somebody could even tell you a little something about like, yeah, with dreams. Like somebody would have made, made it seem like um, they were selling somebody a dream type of energy. Like somebody was trying to sell your ass a dream in the past. Or they were doing this to this person. And um, I'm even getting like somebody is actually being redirected though. Like somebody is going to be like made to seem like one thing was for them. But it's given like, again, something better is, is actually for you. I'm going to take these cards, these two. So we got adventure and individuality. Yep. That's confirmation. Like this next person or thing that's coming in for you um, is actually going to be more attuned to who you are on a soul level. Your individuality, possibly whoever you were with from the past. Like they couldn't even accept all that you were or understand or be like, again, even if it was like seeing like it then, like over time I'm hearing like they wouldn't have been like a good match or something like that. And that's okay. It's just a misalignment. But it's something about Source taking you on a new adventure. I'm hearing for some of you, this new person is going to like to like travel a lot. Um, we seek adventure together. It adds excitement to your journey. Like both of y'all are very curious beings. I'm hearing like, ooh, something about the color pink though, for real, or roses. Um, this is sim sim signifying like love or self love, a very like feminine energy. 
whoever represents the feminine energy, I don't know, they could be the one approaching somebody. I don't know why I got that. That's not for everybody. Nah, you know, some of y'all, you let your person approach you if you want to. But some, I just got, because the emperor, I mean, the empress came out when I asked, like, who's going to be approaching? Like, so it could definitely be like, either somebody's approaching this empress, which could be you, or this empress wants to approach someone. Um, But be wary of possessive partners. Maintain your individuality. And I was getting like, this person from the past, maybe they were very controlling or they were very like, um, you were too you were so different you were like a paradox to somebody and um they couldn't keep up type of energy with the window yeah like it's given like a window of opportunity a new adventure in love is coming so get ready so yeah for many of you sources definitely preparing you for this because you knew it you knew you were settling in the past and this person knew that they were settling in the past um this is why the both of you are being guided towards someone that's actually like a like an equally yo divine match with connection yes i heard that's what was lacking in the past that's why the both of y'all are feeling this anticipation even if you don't have a clue about who each other is. who y'all are like y'all don't know each other's faces yet or like i'm hearing that both of y'all can feel like in y'all good that like something good is about to happen or something different is coming in with wedding so y'all both feel this connection and something about it is going to lead you both to some form of abundance because when you're in alignment with your true divine counterpart, that's when this is when you know you were the karmic though, because you're losing money, opportunities getting taken from you. You just keep you happen to be falling down after mishap after mishap with destiny here. Somebody's a part of your destiny. The abundance. This is why this abundance is going to be flowing like this when you guys come together or you meet. Could even be something that you guys are meant to do together with a long time you definitely could be in a, a, a i heard like a spiritual solitude type of energy you're spending some time alone right now or this person is like in hermit mode um being prepared for like a new yeah well hideaway somebody's definitely like keeping to themselves right now or you're not really like you could be trying to like hide away i'm here like hide away from the media like somebody could be like on social media or like well it's giving like somebody um dressing up yeah you don't feel like dressing it up right now or like maybe somebody's just, like you just been spending time alone Somebody can need to like dress up to them here, and especially if your spirits been kind of down late. Like, girl, put that shit on. You look good. You look good. You feel good. So something about somebody spending some time alone, possibly like hiding away. I mean, even getting like a doing this lover comes in, they're gonna want to spend some alone time with you, like a, a secret, like getaway type of energy. But I actually get that somebody's spending some time alone right now because they're releasing a lot of baggage. They're releasing a lot of baggage. Somebody's definitely meant to be in your life though with gifts here. This person, yeah, I heard. I heard I come bearing gifts. Like this person is not gonna come empty-handed. Anticipation, like somebody's anticipating. With wish, like they've been wishing. This person could have been wishing for um for love like this. I've been waiting so uh, with dreams and wish. Like somebody could be dreaming of you or keeping this a secret. Something about a secret element to this all. Or you both could be like keeping this a secret when this first pops off. I heard for a good reason. Whatever that reason could be, like y'all both will know that with proposal. It definitely could be same sex on here. I wouldn't lie to you. Two different decks is giving like for someone. or It's definitely could be like a lesbian relationship. We got long distance here. So somebody could be like in a long distance relationship or like um somebody could like same sex. That's not for everyone. It's just for few of you guys i see a proposal coming in somebody could propose like a secret getaway or like can we just be friends for now or like how do you feel about like maybe going on a date with me or like but i get that uh yeah okay so whoever this person wants that wants to come in with this proposal is again it could be a king of wands energy somebody that you find very attractive that's very attractive in their own right with the ace of cups Nine of Wands, and again, we got this Bill of Fortune that ain't going nowhere. So that's the energy that it's giving me. It's like, when something is meant for you or meant to be in your life, it ain't going nowhere. It's not going, it's not going to pass you by, baby. It can't. I don't know. Some of y'all could have known this person from the past. I get like a new love energy, but I did see the Six of Cups. But I feel like that will is turning. We want new. We want new. So this Ace, I'm going to go ahead and assume that that's new. And y'all got two different people that could be like battling battling it out for y'all love. I'm not even gonna lie, we got a king of swords out here, it could be an air sign and a fire sign. Um, but the king, this this king of wands, that's the one who had that ace of wands for your ass earlier. Well, now he's coming out with the ace of cups, like it's love there too, but yeah, it's something else, but it's love too. But we got this king of swords who trying to like maybe, maybe like they 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 coming in with the money on or like a big offer. They could come in with some form of like stability with the four of wands, like baby. You definitely can have like more than one person that's one uh 
I mean, her sugar, spice, and everything nice. Like, somebody could feel like you just everything. You check all their boxes with judgment. I mean, with temperance and the four of wands. I don't know. Six of wands. Somebody feel like they're going to be really, really, really happy with you. Six of wands and the two of cups. Like, successful or, like, very successful with the emperor. Again, it could be like an Aries. Heavy Aries with this emperor, king of wands energy. Somebody could be, like, leaving a baby daddy or or this, this, this emperor energy could be, like, going through an ending. Going on with this emperor oh no four swords he's healing four of pentacles i'm here like four 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 energy somebody yeah four 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 of wands four of swords four of pentacles so somebody's like protecting their energy through their cups something about from like friends or like maybe like a third party holding back from a third party Yeah, so y'all can have options. I'm not even gonna lie. Y'all definitely can have options um, that you may not even be interested in these options with the star card, especially if like you are someone who like you get a lot of attention or like the the light is always on you or like you are a very magnetic person. Like you could just be used to this or like uh, Aquarius is definitely significant or somebody has like Aquarius in their chart. Somebody could be like healing from some form of deception. I'm even getting like heavy on like healing from deception and Ten of Pentacles, but don't worry because something long term is gonna come here like. Mm, hold on now. Somebody could be like trying to steal something from y'all too. Be careful of somebody trying to steal your wealth, baby. Especially if like, you are a Capricorn or it's a Capricorn trying to do this to somebody. I'm telling you, ten of pentacles, five of pentacles. Like somebody trying to like take something from somebody. Or like you could be leaving somebody out in the cold. And this could be somebody who thought that they had like a solid position in your life. With the will of fortune. I'm getting like a lot of changes. I'm hearing I'm going through changes in my life. Mm, no, <laughs> but somebody could watch Big Mouth, the show on Netflix, um, about like hormones and shit. Somebody have like a lot of hormonal changes happening right now. But I feel like maybe somebody's watching you because they're ready to bring this change in. Um, I don't know though. Somebody could even be going through some form of like financial struggles due to like karma for being like toxic and juggling you at one point. Two of Swords, Two of Wands. I mean, Two of Swords, Two of Pentacles, or like being unsure about you. This is somebody from the past. Like, yeah, just just know that if you were wondering about somebody from the past or something like that, um, we got Pisces energy here. They're going to get karma. Especially if they were acting like they didn't know what was up with you or something with justice. You're going to get justice. Libra energy, like, literally. This could even be, like, a court case or something like that. It's like, somebody's, you're going to get justice, especially if it was a case where somebody put you in a third party. Two of pentacles, three of pentacles, baby. And the justice is your ace of wands that's coming in. So a new beginning that you're having with someone else or just that you're sparking for yourself. I'm hearing like maybe you felt like again something about the color like somebody could have went through something that was very draining or heartbreaking or tumultuous in the past where now the color is coming back into your life the passion the excitement and I don't know there might be something about like a fire sign coming towards somebody after you went through a very tumultuous situation or this person mm, and it's like somebody's worried I heard like be worried weary of like fake apologies fake energies fake love because baby people show you who they are I fucking believe it <laughs> Fucking believe it. I told y'all I knew who it was. The Empress is this Queen of Pentacles energy. You heavy Taurus. Or like it could be somebody who a, a, a Empress who wants to come towards a Queen of Pentacles. But it's something that you do for work. I feel like this is you though. You could be this Empress Queen of Pentacles energy. Somebody could want to close out a cycle. I don't know. It could be like, let me see. Who, who is this? A Pisces. I don't know. Either somebody's closing out a cycle with a Pisces or a Pisces wants to come towards somebody. A Pisces could be going through like a, a change. Like somebody could be like changing. Um, somebody could be like a, closing out a cycle. And this could be a Pisces or a closing out a cycle with a Pisces to come towards this Queen of Pentacles. We got the full card. I'm definitely telling y'all what I feel. We got the Queen of Cups. We got the Hangman. We got the Seven of Pentacles in the World card. Something about closing out a cycle. Maybe that somebody was investing in. It could be a Pisces doing this. Or a Pisces is, is the one that somebody's closing out a cycle with. With the magician. Yeah. So just know that, especially if you are like a Pisces or a water sign, like you could be manifesting something or someone new into your energy, into your life. Or yeah, some, something about the excitement. Or maybe after you had to walk away from something else or someone else, something is like a hidden. You could be hiding how really you feel about something. I feel like you you could be at your like, you could be very weary in a situation. Like you're tired, but you're still persevering with the Nine of Wands. It's giving like, you still going. Um, although you could be bandaged up and like still healing, but it's like with the moon, you could keep trying to keep your feelings to yourself, which is really somebody was really in a feelings. 
you you are in a very energy of like almost somebody is really blocked off either this is you or somebody else and this could be the either this person that's feeling like people are walking away from them or someone walked away from them it could be a pisces moon with the moon here or cancer with the queen of cups um or someone's like walking away from somebody and somebody could be like really in their feelings or blocking somebody somebody could like block somebody with the nine of wands seven of wands or somebody feels really blocked because of illusions i heard like something is coming to light now with the tower y'all enlightenment like somebody something is something about an illusion like just blew up in somebody's face somebody got clarity jesus like somebody got clarity about where someone wants to be ace of swords somebody got clarity about what somebody want to be and this is broke their heart. Or will once this comes in. Like I'm hearing like. Say somebody tried to get over on you. Say somebody tried to like do you dirty. And act like you wasn't going. I don't know. It's like. Okay. And say that you was in harmony mode and healing. It's like when you pop out. Possibly with this new person. Somebody finna be shitty. Five of cups. Shitty. Because I don't know if somebody thought you weren't going to move forward and choose somebody else. Like somebody's getting clarity though. With the sun. It could be a Leo. Got the Ace of Swords and the Sun out here. That's double clarity. Like somebody I'm hearing, like they didn't know then and they know now. Somebody could have been steady. Like, I don't. Mm. Somebody's. It's like somebody could be watching somebody move forward or. Again, somebody could be watching someone do this. Like watching somebody move on to someone else. Or like this is like now they're. Say that again, somebody hurt you or this person that's coming towards you, like they got hurt. It's like somebody that's watching, whether you or them, it's like somebody that's watching is going to see somebody move forward to somebody that's actually a divine counterpart. And it's going to be like, wow, I fucked up. The nine of cups, because somebody's going to get exactly what they're wanting. Like I'm hearing, I, I, they had they pick out the a vending machine, like you would be the first pick, like you would be, and may say this person was like the third, fourth, like this person is going to see like, damn, like I actually wasn't even like this person's real life, the best that it could get for this person. And I treated them like that, like, wow, 10 of cups the, and the high priestess, heavy Pisces energy. So a Pisces could be getting like a new love. Um, We got the high priestess. You could be this high priestess energy. Trust your intuition. Your intuition could be telling you, baby, don't worry about it. Better is coming in. Okay. Somebody could be like having a very strong intuition, nine of cups, 10 of cups. Like this is going to be somebody like, yeah happiness love and happiness this person gonna want to express their emotions to you a pisces could definitely be significant a gemini something about your intuition telling you this love is coming baby so trust your intuition with the strength leo energy again especially if somebody was i heard like you're stronger than you know sources moving you in a new direction baby towards somebody that i promise you this is going to be somebody that you're you're going to be happy you did not settle on those past relationships just you didn't settle down because the person that's supposed to send you to is actually the one that's going to help you to grow the most, heal the most, love yourself the most. I'm here to stick up for yourself the most. Like, this person not going to play about you. They're going to be an equal protector as you are to them, equal reciprocity. They're not going to be somebody that want to take from you, steal from you, use you with the hierophant because they're sent by the divine. I'm hearing that you asked the divine about that last person or them last people. Or was it more so of like a you trying to put things into your own hands? with judgment here so the divine is calling judgment the divine is like i'm gonna make sure you get what you deserve but ask me first next time because i could have shaved i could have saved you this trouble on that somebody could have just shaved or may want to shave um, <laughs> yeah something about like shaving is significant I'm, I'm hearing or gardening nine of pentacles eight of wands like you could be single right now um, i see communication is definitely gonna come in but wait for it three of wands wait for what you deserve the chariot because when this comes in like it's going to pick up really fast Somebody's going to help you. It's something about the light. Like, um, say you have a light to you. Like, somebody's going to expand your light. Or, like, people from the past could have been, like, more so. Like, you were the light and they were, like, eating off of your light. Or, like, you know, and then in the same sense, trying to dim it. But it's like this person's going to have a light on them as well. So, it's like y'all both are going to be equally shiny. And, like, helping each other to shine and, 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 and to, like, you know, feel good. Or something about, like, it's, I just give that. Um, and for some of y'all, it's like somebody who was very emotionally manipulative to y'all in the past is going to be so jealous. It could be or like a water sign masculine energy or like somebody's going to be like um, jealous to see that you guys have moved forward because somebody could have thought that you were never going to move on from them or like you were never going to find. I was hearing cancer. It's a cancer from the past for some of y'all who thought that you wasn't going to move past or refine better. This Knight of Wands is cancer. I'm hearing specifically. 
but they the ones who still stuck in the same situations literally seven of swords this is the person who i'm hearing like no matter they waiting for a change and there's no change with the seven of swords they keep meeting themselves and different people while you're moving forward and flourishing this is a clown with the king of swords and they realize it like the truth that they're getting is that they're the clown because for some of you you actually met somebody new it could be an air sign. Like, just take what resonates. Like, I feel like somebody who don't play about you is coming, though. And with this Two of Cups energy, somebody is like, I feel like people, too, be trying to send conflicts your way. Or, like, you just got people who, like, let me get this card, y'all. Excuse me. Who try to send conflict your way or just secretly, like, jealous to see that you are finding or, yeah, people who, who love you. I'm hearing even if it's just, like, platonic, like, just equal, like, love. Because somebody couldn't do that for you themselves. And whoever this next person is, they're going to really want to, like, treat you right. Wine and dine you type of energy. Fine wine. Ace of Swords. I'm hearing, like, yes, this person is going to want to remind you every day of how much you mean to them with the High Priestess. Heavy Pisces energy. Learn you inside and out. I'm hearing they're going to be able to feel out the energy when, like, you, when you're not feeling too good. Like, this person has a very strong intuition, too. How to deal with you on certain days that you did not deal with. But, you know, like, how to kind of, like, flow with your energy so that it's, like, a, a temperance. I promise you, I heard that in my head. It's that equal, like, balance. It's going to, both of y'all going to be, like, yin and yang. Oh. Four of wands. 11, 11 energy. <laughs> five, 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 baby. That's change. And I'm going to wait till it. Five, 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 five. So, like, baby, 55, 55, change is coming in, especially after, like, an ending Scorpio energy transformations. The Nine of Cups. Like, yeah, baby. You are somebody's full-on wish fulfillment with the lovers. Six of Swords. Somebody secretly, like, could feel, like, guided towards you. Or, like, they're going to be guided. This lover, this lover, Queen of Pentacles. This lover is coming in for this Queen of Pentacles. So, hold on to your pentacle right now. Y'all gonna be surprised, I heard. <laughs> King and Queen of Pentacles, I'm gonna tell y'all why. I was like, y'all gonna be surprised. The tower, I don't feel like that's a bad tower. I get a shock factor. Like, this shit is be sending me when Swords be like, yo, yo. <laughs> With the Nine of Pentacles, like, that's the energy. I heard, like, surprise. Like, you could go from being single to, like, all of a sudden, like, somebody telling you, like, bro, you literally everything I want in a person. Not even on no love bomb and shit, but, like, but I'm here, like, they're not going to come out and tell you it like that. I get a very, like, gradually with the Knight of, I mean, with the Page of Pentacles. Like, it's going to grow over time to the Nine of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles. Like, it's going to grow over time because that's going to make, that's how you're going to make sure this is right. So you're going to be sure. No, like, doubts and, like, you know. Because somebody could have a tendency to, like, overthink or keep themselves stuck due to, like, fear or, like, holding on to, like, things that they know no longer serves them. But I feel like somebody's going to really be sure moving towards you. And it's a, it's a case of, like, um... Yeah, Six of Wands. Somebody's going to be very successful. Somebody could be afraid of, like, being put in a third party. Like, that could be somebody's fear. Ten of Wands are like, ooh, they and backstab them because I'm feeling like a pain in my back now. Somebody definitely wants to take action towards you guys though but i heard like be careful with somebody from the past trying to come back around and apologize because i feel like you guys are going to know that that's an illusion or you're going to be able to see through somebody um and focus on things that are like long term for you with the sun and the ten of pentacles things that make you happy things that are here to stay and not to play things that are healing for you yeah, yeah. things that are sure of you with the hermit here or people that are sure of you. Many of you could be like in harmony mode right now, protecting your energy. And again, I just get the sense that people are going to be coming back or a particular person from the past. And it's like you're going to be able to see through this person with judgment. And you're going to make a judgment call on that person. They're going to be like, wow, you've never acted like this towards me before with uh, the emperor coming out again. Some of y'all just like your baby daddy. Some of y'all, it's the emperor that's like in their feelings over you, maybe Aries, Ace of Pentacles. It could be this person that wants to bring you this Ace of Pentacles. But just know that this is definitely going to be coming in for you when it's time. Can I get one more card? The Eight of Pentacles. So continue to work on yourself. Continue to like invest in yourself. You could be working on your career right now or certain craft. Again, just working on self. I feel like this could even be where this blessing is coming from. Like many of you are going to be in a very stable energy when this person does show up. Like before they even get here, you're going to be the star energy. So it's like perfect alignment. Like this is somebody who's again going to be able to meet you at that level though. So this could be somebody who gets a lot of attention too. Or somebody that's a star in their own rider. They shine just as brightly as you. They're very healing too. And then I heard something about like not satisfied or things just not really equal. It's just something about the past where things just wasn't fully correct. Because this is, this is why I'm getting like 
this is why something about somebody going through a transformation towards this ten of cups energy it's this emperor heavy aries so somebody could be doing a lot of healing work right now because baby they've been making plans for you so many of y'all don't even see this coming they may not even see it coming but it's coming um I do want to pull a couple more from this deck, and then I'll close out. I'll say like maybe three. Thank you, Sawyer. Can I get three more cards with celebrate? You're about to celebrate with, with the butterfly here, a transformation as somebody. It says you will meet a new love interest at a party or a night out. So some of y'all going to meet somebody new when you're going out for like drinks from the celebrate or enjoy yourself. Somebody's birthday could be coming up. I'm even getting like, um again, somebody's going to do like a, um, a transformation. We got long distance. True love. So, yeah, many of you, you were going to align with your true love. And like I was saying, it didn't feel right in the past. You were settling because that wasn't your true love. This is why you feel it. Like, you don't know how you feel what you feel with twin flame here. Like, you just feel it, even if you don't know who this person is. Right now, in the physical, on the soul level, your soul knows, like, yes, 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 daddy's coming. <laughs> or, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, sparks is going to fly. This could be a twin flame. Somebody that, like I said, y'all match each other on every level. One more card source with trust. And you're going to be able to trust this person. I heard trust is something very big for someone here. Someone could have broken your trust in the past or people in the past. Listen, what, look what's popping out, settling. People you were settling for, they, those people couldn't be trusted. But this new love, baby, they're going to be able to have all of your trust. And they're going to be able to rest assured. And I'm here to be able to reassure you when you need it. They're going to understand you on a soul level. Something I heard, I, I understand a little bit about something about what you went through. Like somebody going to be able to understand, shit, this transformation that you've had to go, on, go through. So trust in the divine timing. Trust that this is true love showing up for you guys. Okay, with that four of wands energy, that's twin flame energy. So for some of you, you guys are like mirroring each other. Um, this is bond is going to be a deep love that endures time. A true love too. So yeah, that is the reading you guys. Um, I'm hearing uh, flaws and all by Beyonce. So somebody's going to, you feel like somebody wouldn't accept you flaws and all, but they would. Like you feel like somebody wouldn't be able to, this is going to be a very healed person for swords or like somebody can feel this way about you that maybe you couldn't. Ace of Wands, like I'm telling you guys. Ooh, I heard healing sex, y'all. I'm not even going to lie. I heard healing sex. Like somebody can have some good ass sex. <laughs> Baby making sex justice. And that's your justice. Like somebody gonna have like eye rolling, toes, what was I gonna say? Toes curling type of sex. A hierophant, like what? Divine punani. She said, You wanna smell my punani? It's all about poetic justice. This is gonna be poetic justice, okay? With the judgment here. Justice, I mean, liberal energy and Taurus energy with the hierophant. Like, source is gonna send somebody straight to their person. And I'm hearing, baby, that's your justice. You know it's your justice because you did not fold after you went through those treacherous i'm hearing tragic situations in the past whether it was with lovers or not but listen karmically the wheel has turned the devil and the will of fortune like you went through like a karmic cycle in your life in the past with the six of cups literally it was down here damn it was turning you every which way but loose could be a fire sign i feel like this fire sign for to come towards somebody or you don't have to be a fire sign you could just view this person as being very attractive heavy taurus energy Somebody could even been like planning to do something deceptive to you or they something something happened de deceptively. Taurus could have been involved or a fire sign. Have you on a fire sign? Either Aries the old Sag or a Taurus Libra energy. And I feel like whoever was trying to send a tax your way or like block anything in your life or like send just really conflict energy your way or just get in the way of whatever. I, this person is worried because the two of cups. I'm telling y'all, some of y'all got like this relationship coming in and somebody is just so worried that the star is going to be very healing and elevating for you hope the star is hope because you have not lost hope with the emperor this, again it could be like an aries energy who's working on themselves with the lovers and the ace of swords like yeah y'all got a lover that's coming in gemini energy who's going to see you as full-on wish fulfillment i'm hearing oh the, the places we shall go or something like that ten of cups like you and this person will go a lot of places or travel the world together or like just grow and evolve together so that is the reading, you guys. This is full on wish fulfillment coming your way. Have hope. Remain hopeful no matter what you go through. Don't close yourself off and let one bad experience like taint the rest of like what life can bring for you or relationships and like opportunities. Yeah, don't close yourself off. Do not close yourself off, please. Don't close yourself off. Because somebody could be in a real energy right now where you, you could be a little hurt or like somebody's crying over spilled milk with the five of cups. But it's more the full card. Source is like, look, these cups is on the flow, right? But it's two more still standing. That shit was supposed to fall. Let it fall. That shit was a little spoiled anyway. You ain't even want that shit. Look at this cup. Mm, nice. It's a large. The other cup was, was a goddamn small or a medium. <laughs> I don't know. 
Like she is, this is just going to be better. Eight of Wands. This resource is going to help you to move forward and move something forward with the chariot. You said the fast, two fastest moving cars in the day. So something could be coming in quicker than you expect with the Knight of Pentacles after you waited a while for this. So just just have patience, you guys. Everybody's on a different timeline. Some of y'all just could come in quicker than others, but somebody's like still healing right now, or like. But you're supposed to just be, you know, you're exactly where you need to be. So that's the reading, you guys. Um. Any type of feedback would be greatly appreciated. Thank you so much for watching the reading. I truly do hope this answered the questions that remain in y'all hearts or that you were needing some form of clarity about. And uh, I love you guys. That's all.